Good evening. This is my channel and uh, I have well over 4,000 uh, varied videos uploaded on that channel. Some of them, you know, are only a couple of minutes long and some of them are actually maybe 20 minutes, 25 minutes long. But once they go onto YouTube, once I upload them on YouTube, I normally delete them. But what happens if I want to uh, get them back on my desktop, maybe to edit or to uh, put together with another bit of footage or for whatever reason? How do I resurrect uh, my videos off YouTube? Well, actually, it's not that difficult. If I want any of these videos again, as long as my channel is working, you can do it. I can do it. Right, so this is, this is how it's done. Um, there's a video I want to uh, resurrect again. I want to have this video on my desktop. It lasts for 2 minutes and 39 seconds. And it's Marvelous Melodious Madeira Atlantic Canary. So if I want that video on my desktop once again, first of all, I've got to find out exactly what the... Uh, and we're sitting in the... The YouTube um, title is the URL. So there it is up there. So I want to copy that. All right. Highlight and click copy. Right, the next thing that I do to get this video resurrected on my desktop is to go online onto Cap Wing Studio. Right, so I'll click on that. So there's Cap Wing Studio, and you can upload videos off YouTube, your own channel, or anybody else's channel for that matter. Though why you would want to be doing this, I don't know. Um, <laughs> sometimes I do, very, very rarely, um, when somebody has pointed me in the direction of that particular video and they allow me to copy their video. But it's very, very rare. So I go on to Capwing Studio and I click on Get Started. And here's where I want in here. This will come up. So I've already copied the uh, the YouTube video. I want the URL. It's up here. So I put it in here. And I paste it. Now I wait for a minute or two. And there it's been uploaded. Right? And it's 2 minutes and 39 seconds. So there we are. Next thing I do is I export video. I click this green box up in here. And it says sign in to remove watermark. It's free. So I can upload videos for free uh, using Cap Wing. Now it says here export without signing in or uh, export with a watermark. So I don't really care about having a, a cap wing, a small cap wing watermark in the bottom right hand corner. So I'll just go for export with watermark. So there it's, it's uploading it. 51% complete. And I wait. All right, it's only a matter of a couple of minutes. And the whole video is uploaded onto Capwing. And you know that because the sound and the film start running. Now the next thing to do is go to this box here. Download. And there's it's already downloaded. So I make the screen smaller by clicking the box up here. 
and I click this box here or these three dots here and there's my downloads so download and there's my video so I just bring it across and I just click it just to make sure that it's the right one and there it is and that's my wee uh, birdie video and there he is so job done and that only took what a couple of minutes so if you want to upload um, your own YouTube videos or indeed anybody else who gives you permission it's uh, actually uh, I'm not sure whether it's illegal to download anybody else's videos uh, without their permission but it's, uh, you know that's not a thing that you want to be doing um, you know you're basically stealing somebody else's video if you do it without their permission but uh, I'm, I'm uh, trying to save a few of my own old videos and uh, I find this very very handy <coughs> excuse me cap wing studio for downloading a video that you think that you have lost and to retrieve it back onto your uh, desktop